Hello Tikis. While I am working with create a chart action, I got an error. What is the error? Cloud connector failed with status code forbidden. Now if you see over here, I got the error details in a such a way. Cloud connector called failed with the status code forbidden and the location of the subflow. It's an action name create a chart. And if I went in detail with the copying details, I got in a such a way, you can see over here, additional information status code is 403 and the message is null. An internal message, you can see over here, message ACL checked fail. And the inner error, I got it the message as initiator not allowed to create a thread for the initiator. All right. And you can see the headers over here and the link of the particular thing has been given over here. Now, to solve this error, I got few steps over here what are the steps now if you go back to the power automate desktop to create a chart what we are going to do we are going to give the connection references over here this connection reference between power automate desktop and the microsoft teams correct now to accept the request we have to make some changes or we have to enable the api at the microsoft teams what are the steps we need to follow Let's switch back to the Microsoft Teams and there you can see I'm having three dots that is settings and more. Let's click on that and then I'm going for the settings. And there you can see I'm having menu over here such as general accounts and organization. And then we are having privacy. Let's select the privacy. Inside the privacy, go to the third party app API. We have to enable this API over here. Let's click on manage API. And there you can see to enhance the team's calling by enabling the third party apps or devices to manage, we have to enable the API. Now, this has been disabled. That's why we got the error cloud connector failed with status code as forbidden. Let's enable this and it will allow the request from the third party applications. All right. Let me click on cancel. Let's run the flow that error is occurring or not. The flow has executed successfully. Now, whenever you got the error that is cloud connector failed with the status code as forbidden for the Microsoft Teams while connecting from Power Automate desktop, we have to follow the steps that is enabling the API in the Microsoft Teams. I hope you understand the solution for the error cloud connector failed with status code as forbidden as part of this tutorial.